Hello, my name is Sanjay and this session is about monitoring website and website URL with Nagios Excel. So monitoring website can be done within a few clicks with Nagios monitoring wizard. Move to configure configuration wizard. There you find a search bar where you can type website and you will be populated with this thing. Website, website defacement and website URL. So website wizard is used to monitor the steady state aspects of a website. Website URL wizard is very similar and allows you to monitor the status and content of a specific URL. Let's take a walkthrough of using these wizards. So let's go to website. On step 1 enter the URL of your website. So https colon www.visualpath.in Click next. On step 2, you will define the monitoring options. Here you can define which services you want to add for this site. Here you can give your hosting. So I will give here visual path underscore website. This is the IP address which is resolved to this URL or website. This is the port number 443. It's using SSL because the website URL begins with HTTPS. So it is the default it has taken. If you want to change it to something else, you can change here. On redirect, whatever you want. If your website is showing redirected, you can choose any of this. I will keep it okay for now. Credentials if required. Moving forward, we have website services. Specify which services you would like to monitor to the website. You can check and check here. So HTTP includes basic monitoring of the website to ensure the web server responds with a valid HTTP response. Ping monitors to ICMP ping. DNS resolution monitors the website DNS name to ensure it resolves to the valid IP address. DNS IP match monitors the website DNS name to ensure it resolves to the current known IP address. So it should match to this IP. This is web page content. Monitors the website to ensure the specified string is found on the content of the web page. So let us see. So this is our website. And I want to monitor this content. So I will do simply copy and paste. This is case sensitive. This must be the exact in, in case which it is available here. In next page you can provide some regular expression. Say I want to put this. SSL certificate will help you monitor the expiration date of the website's SSL and alerts you if it expires within the specified number of days. You can edit it if you want to get alert before 30 days. Click on next and this, this is the polling interval 5 minutes, 1 minute and 5, five times and click on finish. This will create the new host and services and begin monitoring. Once the wizard applies the configuration, click view stage details for Visual Path website. Here you can see the new host and services that were created. As the polling interval is 5 minutes, we need to wait for 5 minutes. So what we can do is we can force immediate check and see what we are getting. So after applying immediate check, we have this service status and the website configured here. So here we saw how we can monitor a website and its matrix. Let's see how to monitor a website URL. Here search for a website. Click on website URL. Put your web website URL here. change.nagios.org slash direct click on next here you will be asked for hostname I will give nagios exchange URL this is the service name prefix I can give it anything but let it be underscore directory this is the IP address that which is resolved to this URL so this is URL options. Using SSL option because the URL begins with HTTPS. Default port 43 is taken. If you have some other port, you can define here. These are the credentials if required. Moving forward to URL services, it monitors URL status, URL content, and URL content regular expression match. So 
This will give you the basic monitoring of the URL to ensure the web server responds with a valid HTTP response. If it is not responding, then an alert will be generated. URL content, let us see. Let's copy this and uh, locate it here. Let's see what content we need to monitor. So let us monitor this content. So this is the URL content that I want to monitor. URL content regular expression and this one. Click next and then finish. Here you can see the check interval is 5 minutes. If some problem is detected, then only it will check every 1 minute up to 5 times. Okay. So finish. This will create a new host and services and begin monitoring. Once the wizard applies the configuration, you can click on the view status details for Nigeria and exchange URL. And you can see the host and the newly created services. The following interval is 5 minutes, so we will do a force check. Now let's check the status of our website URL and its metrics. Here now we can see all are showing OK. That means the URL is in healthy state and we are good to go. So this was all about monitoring website and website URL with Nikeos XI. Thank you for watching. See you in the next session.